Hey everyone, Scott J. Way from Crucible Custom Props, Norfolk's Lab and all the forms here. So today we have a first for me. Um, this is the uh, DV6 or the Darth Vader Stunt Saber from Return of the Jedi made on a vintage Graflex uh, using the Wanawanga kit of all the parts. Um, vintage, nope, not a vintage Cobalt. This is the reproduction Cobalt. Um, so I think it's all one one got parts, except for the Graflex itself. Uh, oh, and this is a vintage ball catch. Um, uh, otherwise, the rest is all from the the kit, the one one got kit, including the inside uh, Delrin chassis tube thing. So used Roy's blueprints, used those templates for drilling holes and everything, and everything worked out great. Uh, if you follow those holes and hole guides, you'll get everything lined up perfectly and drilled perfectly and as funky as the original prop. So uh, I just wanted to kind of show this off. This one's about to get packed up and go to a new home. Uh, being a vintage Graflex, it's had, it has its own marks and stuff like that. But I did try to match as many of the very noticeable marks on the uh, original prop as you can see in some of the some of the photos, even some of the, the little nicks and stuff on the T-Track I did add that I could see in the photos, um, the rusty D-ring, uh, all that stuff. So this is it, here it is. Um, I always kind of, I, I did like this a long time ago, uh, then kind of went off of it for quite a while, never thought much of it. Um, but lately have been seeing it more and more and uh, I think it's a really cool addition to a Sabre collection uh, definitely a interesting one in fact uh, one of my toys from the 90s I, I'm, I date way before the 90s but when all that stuff in the 90s came back out I was given gifts and started getting some of those and one of those uh, collapsible blade lightsabers was based on this <clears throat> so uh, somewhere in the house I have one of those old flashlight style lightsabers that is based on the DV6 here so pretty neat but anyway, this is it. Just wanted to show you what the Wanawanga kit looks like along with a vintage Graflex. And uh, that's it. So, pretty cool. Thanks for looking.